This is the free motion quilting tutorial for Calm C. This design is being sponsored by the Ultimate Quilting Kit. Get the three best tools for free motion quilting, the Supreme Slider, the Machinegers Quilting Gloves, and Little Genie Magic Bob and Washers at freemotionquilt.com. Now let's learn how to stitch Calm C in free motion. The first step is to simply stitch a long, gently flowing line. You're working this design from edge to edge, but that doesn't mean it has to stretch all the way to the other edge initially. I'm just simply kind of stitching these wiggly wavy lines, um, overlapping and interlocking them. Uh, you can see that I kind of connect with the sides and the edges and travel stitch along them and then branch out. I'm trying to keep it consistent at least the width of the lines. So about um, in this situation about a quarter of an inch away but of course if you had uh, wanted to stitch this on a bigger scale, wanted to stitch this on a bigger quilt, you could of course expand this and put a lot more space between those lines of quilting. So you can see how this is stacking up. It's really just kind of these curvy flowy lines stacked up on top of one another, travel stitching and flowing together, trying to make the look of stacks of waves, um, very very gently flowing waves. And it works from one edge to the other, so you can see I'm just kind of backtrack and I wiggle forward and then I wiggle across and constantly changing direction as far as just just basically straight up and straight down but I'm not always stitching perfectly straight across the piece. So I fast forwarded a bit here so you can see how this texture looks over your quilting space after you've stitched a good bit of it. And you can see how this flowing texture looks especially the travel stitching really stands out. And the reason for that is anywhere two layers of thread uh, are stitched on top of one another, that's of course going to be darker and stand out more than a single layer of thread. And it's something to play with. It's something to experiment with with this design if you want more of that darker texture to enhance and try and stitch more travel stitching. And if you want less of that darker thread texture to just simply try and travel stitch the least amount possible. So here's what it looks like whenever you stitch Calm C. For the Ultimate Quilting Kit, as well as 250 more videos on free motion quilting, go to daystyledesigns.com or freemotionquilt.com.